Yeah, it's it's tough when guys are out, but um, you know you have to have other players step up, and you know I think our guys um, will do a good job for us, no questions. Um, we're lucky we have been using uh, a lot of different people uh, throughout the year. The ball's been you know finding different guys throughout the year, so uh, we got a number of guys who who are ready to go, and um, we just got to focus in the next two days, make sure that we're prepared and and ready for the game on Sunday. Yeah, you know, Christian has played here. You know, I've, I've played with him for a number of years. And so, um, you know, I think he's done a nice job in the past for us when he, you know, has had to step up and, and play. And um, I have complete confidence in him. And I, I think Tajay uh, has done a nice job for us this year. The ball found him in a critical situation in the New York game. And uh, it was a huge third down conversion for us. Plus, he's a guy who's played a ton in Tennessee. Uh, very comfortable with the system and, you know, I think does a great job. And if, you know, Juwan gets a chance, I think, you know, Juwan's worked really hard uh, in the in the few years he's been here. And, and he'll take full advantage of that opportunity. What's different this time from 14? You all, we came, we all came a little earlier. Uh, this one is a different, different feel, it seems like. Yeah, I think, you know, um, obviously the schedule, the routine is is different from, you know, the last time I came over here in 2014. And we spent a week here uh, to get ready for that game. And, um, you know, Coach 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 Smith this time, uh, you know, it was a different Coach Smith. But, you know, Art this time, you know, has, has a plan for us to get ready. And you know, I think for the most part for the week, the guys have done a really good job uh, practicing back in Atlanta. And then, you know, getting over here today and getting the meetings done, getting onto the practice field, moving around a little bit, spending some time in the weight room. I think everybody, um, you know, is, is feeling pretty good right now after practice. So we'll get some rest the next two days and be ready to go Sunday. Mike, Mike uh, Davis tweeted out that the time change is killing him. Uh, <laughs> the guys a little uh, soft out there practice today, a lot of it? No, you know, I, I, I thought it was pretty good. I, I, I think the the meeting, the, the the morning meetings, you know, uh, we were in there about nine, nine thirty, ten, something like that. Where it's still about five o'clock body time, you know, you're still uh, getting yourself going. But by the time we got out of here and over out in the fresh air and onto the field, uh, I thought it was a really good, you, you know, jog through type practice for us um, to be on the mental stuff to get the blood flowing a little bit. And it, even Mike, you know, even Mike did a good job. So it was uh, it was actually you know pretty good. I don't think so. I, I think guys will get their rest. It wasn't, it was just a lot of coffee and, and that kind of stuff, uh, just trying to get the brain firing uh, early on. But for the most part, I thought it was pretty good. Hey, Matt, so you mentioned it earlier, both yourself and Cordell played the Monday before. It seems to have unlocked the magic keys to get everything out of and out of Cordell. Can we, are we going to see that relationship in the game on Sunday? I hope so. You know, he's, he's done a great job for us uh, in the first four games, I think. Uh, made a ton of plays both in the run game and in the pass game. He, he's a talented player. Um, he's a bit of a throwback, kind of an old, an old school type player. He does a little bit of everything, and uh, so it's you know it's fun to be around guys that are that competitive and and you know want the ball and want to make plays. And um, you know I hope he can continue to to be you know as effective for us as he's been in the first four games. I mean, obviously, it's tough when when you don't have all of your guys, you know, and and um, you know both Calvin and, and Russell Gage for us are talented players, uh, and and been really productive. But I think when you're out there, you know, it's it's different because a lot of where the ball goes is dictated off of how coverage is played, and so you got to trust the guys that um, you know that that are out there that they're going to be in the right spot where they're supposed to be, and. Um, you know, that's why we work so hard during the preseason and take reps, you know, with everybody and, and try and create as much timing and, and um, you know, and, and, a, and a feel for each other as much as possible. So uh, I think our guys will do a good job. You know, obviously hurts, you know, when you don't have your guys, but I think our guys will do a good job and step up. It's pretty cool. You know, I, I loved uh, Wembley was a really, 
really cool experience, a really unique experience. Um, and, and that's what everybody has mentioned to us uh, about the stadium at Tottenham is, is that you know, it's not only built for football over here, but it, like you mentioned, also has some of the NFL uh, in mind uh, with how it was built. So I'm excited to see it. Um, you know, I'm really looking forward to playing there on Sunday. I'm going to chill. <laughs> uh, you know, I got a quiet hotel room. Kids back at home. Uh, this is a good chance to get a lot of sleep. So I'm going to relax this afternoon, you know, have, have a nice dinner tonight, and then just chill out. How about you? What are you going to do tonight? <laughs> so, yeah, perfect. Yeah. Yeah, it's good. Yeah, I really do. You know, I, I think we're in a good space. Uh, we've had a really good week of, of preparation, you know, back in Atlanta and here today. And I think that's, um, you know, that's a recipe for success. I think if you continue to prepare really well, you know, eventually we're going to see the fruits of our labor. And so I'm hoping that can start here and I uh, feel really confident that, you know, we're going to go out there and play well Sunday. Yeah, I think, you know, obviously it's, you know, for the entire world, it's been a strange, you know, two years. And so uh, for us to be the first, it's my first time traveling internationally, um, you know, since uh, since the pandemic started. And I think the NFL, I think our organization, everybody's done a really good job of, of you know, getting us as safe as possible. Uh, We've done a great job as an organization, 100% vaccinated, which I think helps. And so um, I think we've taken all the necessary steps to make it as safe as possible. And, um, you know, we're excited to be here. Yeah, I think, you know, Kyle will do a good job for us. I think he's continued to get better, you know, in his rookie year, the first four games. Every every game there's been improvement. And, uh, you know, that's got to be the, the theme for him this entire year and this week is just, you know, a little bit better every week. Uh, and, and I thought he did a great job in practice for us this week. So, you know, I'm hoping he can uh, he can go out there and translate translate that into the game and play, you know, really effectively for us. I think we got to get the result number one, you know, and, and I think if we get the result and play the way that, you know, we're capable of, I hope they find that entertaining. Um, but, you know, job number one is, is to come over here and get the job done. I think their defensive line has done a great job uh, in, in four games of creating pass rush and, and pressure. And um, they did a really nice job. I think it was, I think nine sacks last week. So, um, you know, on third down, they've been effective. They play a lot of tight man coverage. They do a nice job with that, too. Uh, so you've got to be really good up front, and we've got to make sure that, you know, we're, you know, doing a really good job on the outside, too, getting the ball out, getting open, you know, protecting, running the football. Uh, all those things are, are important when you're going against a good defense. Um, I don't think my approach, you know, I've, I've tweaked my schedule here and there and my routine and how I train, you know, to accommodate for the for the seven more years of, of miles I've put on my body. You know, I think, um, you know, how I train is, is different from back then. Uh, but the approach is the same. You know, I, I try and work as hard as I can every week uh, to give myself a chance to play the best that I, you know, can to help the team. And so, you know, I don't think from, from that standpoint much has changed. Well, I think, you know, he's made some great plays. Um, you look at some of the, the plays that he's made, extending it outside the pocket, throwing it down the field. Uh, they're, they're special talent plays, and, and I've been impressed with that. Um, 
you know, I think it's it's never an easy task to come in and play as a rookie. And uh, I'm not sure if it's more difficult now than it was in 2008 when I started, but um, wasn't easy then either, you know. And so uh, you learn a ton uh, during that time. And I'm sure, you know, th this year is going to be a huge learning curve for him, and he's only going to continue to improve and get better as a player. Well, I think, you know, I, I think the energy comes up. You change your venue, and it's a little bit different. There's a level of excitement, you know, that comes with those kind of things. So I don't think the energy is going to be an issue. I think, you, you know, the biggest thing is to just make sure we're focused on, you know, our plan and the details. I think the energy from our guys has been good really, uh, you know, the entire year, and I expect the same this Sunday. And, you know, the most important thing is, you know, between now and kickoff on Sunday is that we hammer home the details of our plan. Um, I'm sorry, what, can you repeat that one more time? Oh, yeah, Youngway's the best. Uh, I love him. Uh, he's done a great job for us, um, you know, in, in the last two years of kicking. He's been clutch, game-winning field goal this year against the New York Giants. Uh, he's a Pro Bowl player last year. I'm proud of him. He's been a great teammate, and uh, he's doing a great job for us. Thank you.